Essentially, the James Webb Telescope has provided the most precise image of Proxima b in history, revealing breathtaking snippets of knowledge into what might be a habitable exoplanet. It obliges us, as we set out on an excursion through space, to uncover the secrets of Proxima b and determine whether it could be the next Earth. We ought to take off into the vast expanse of space, where a mysterious planet exists in its star's habitable zone, Proxima Centauri. This planet is not just any ordinary rock. As Proxima b demonstrates, it can be found just 4.2 light-years away from us. This planet is covered in mysteries and wonders. Could it be another Earth, with seas and life blossoming on its surface? However, there's more. Proxima b isn't alone in that system. It orbits around the red dwarf star Proxima Centauri, and it has a companion, Proxima Centauri c. Who knows what other mysteries the star system holds? There might even be another companion that we haven't yet discovered. The secrets don't. Stop there. Proxima Centauri produces roughly the same amount of energy, relative to its size, as Earth receives from our Sun. Could this genuinely imply there's water on Proxima b's surface, and perhaps even life? As we explore beyond our own solar system, we encounter an entirely new universe of exoplanets, planets that orbit stars other than the Sun. With over 200 billion stars in the universe, opportunities for discovering exoplanets are endless. Some, exoplanets even wander freely, without any connection to any stars, space travelers among the stars. Among them all, Proxima Centauri b stands out as an especially striking and captivating planet. It has a year that lasts only 112 Earth days, and orbits its star at a distance generally closer than Earth is to the Sun. Indeed, one side of the planet is constantly washed in sunlight, while the opposing side exists in everlasting darkness. Now, let's examine Proxima Centauri, the star around which Proxima b revolves. Proxima Centauri is part of the Alpha Centauri system, which includes three stars, Alpha Centauri a, Alpha Centauri b, and Proxima Centauri, also called Alpha Centauri c. Together, these stars form the closest star system to our solar system. See? Two stars, Alpha Centauri a and b, form a binary system, g and k-type stars, that appear as one star in the Centaurus constellation, and are among the brightest in the night sky. Proxima Centauri, a red dwarf or M-type star, is located roughly 21 light-years from the other two stars, about four times the distance between Earth and the Sun. It is the closest star to us. In fact, Proxima means the closest, in Latin. It was discovered in 1915 by Scottish astronomer Robert Innes. Even though it is our closest celestial neighbor, Proxima Centauri is not visible to the naked eye, having an apparent magnitude of 1113, much fainter than the human eye's limit of 6.5. Don't let that fool you. Proxima Centauri is still a red dwarf star worth studying. In fact, red dwarfs like Proxima are among the most common and energy-efficient stars in the galaxy. Although they don't produce a lot of energy, the internal convection processes in their cores keep them shining for trillions of years. Proxima Centauri is expected to remain a main-sequence star for another four trillion years. On the other hand, the habitability of red dwarf stars like Proxima is still debated. For one, it's a flare star, meaning it has frequent and intense explosions. As a low-mass star, its habitable zone is much closer than the Sun's, projected to be somewhere in the range of 0.23 to 0.54 AU. But this zone is not as comfortable as it may seem. Proxima b is bombarded by intense ultraviolet radiation, much stronger than what we get from our sun. It's so extreme that even the smallest particles of hydrogen, along with oxygen and nitrogen, are stripped away. But that isn't all. Just because a planet is in the right position, at the right distance from its star, doesn't mean it can sustain life. Proxima b may not have a stable atmosphere, which is essential for controlling temperature and maintaining a water-friendly surface. Without it, living creatures would be vulnerable to harsh space weather, making life nearly impossible. So while Proxima b might appear Earth-like on the surface, it is far from being able to support life. 
scientists remain cautious, as there are numerous factors that make it hostile. Still, the mission to uncover the truth about Proxima b continues, and some still hold hope. One tool that has drawn astronomers' attention is the James Webb Telescope. Following years of anticipation, the telescope was finally launched in 2021, and now helps us determine whether life could exist on Proxima b. However, as with everything in science, things are never as clear as they seem. Several adjustments were needed to ensure the telescope delivers accurate images. As Abby Tabor, a theoretical physicist at Harvard, demonstrates, whether a planet like Proxima b can support life depends on its ability not only to absorb light from its star, but also to emit it as infrared radiation. The James Webb Telescope was specifically designed to detect this infrared light. It can capture images from a planet's surface and search for patterns that could confirm the presence of water or an atmosphere. But what if the planet has an atmosphere that's not conducive to life? The presence of an atmosphere doesn't guarantee the presence of life. Ed Turner, an astrophysicist at Princeton University, warns that Proxima b could be like Venus with a thick, dense atmosphere and extreme temperatures that would make life impossible. The journey to unravel the mysteries of Proxima b is not without its difficulties, but the James Webb Telescope holds promise. There are additional cost considerations. Space scientists are feeling the pressure to find innovative ways to observe planets like Proxima b. Much is at stake, but the potential rewards are even greater. The are opportunity to explore the unknown, to uncover the secrets of a distant planet that holds the potential for life, is a pursuit worth chasing. If the exoplanet were habitable, might we one day visit it? It is, after all, the exoplanet closest to us. That alone makes Proxima b captivating, almost like exploring our own backyard. Even more exciting is that it's roughly the same size as Earth and its location in the habitable zone, suggests it could indeed have life-sustaining conditions. Its proximity also makes it an ideal target in our search for life beyond Earth. Despite being close, we cannot yet go there. Still, it's a prime candidate for future interstellar missions. Think about exploring this exoplanet that looks like Earth. One of the most exciting advancements in space exploration is the concept of using solar sails. It would take 75,000 Years for spacecraft like Voyager 2 to reach Proxima Centauri, but solar sails offer a solution. These ultra-thin sails could propel vehicles traveling to the Alpha Centauri system, and Proxima along with it. Solar pressure would keep the spacecraft on course, eliminating the need for fuel. Here's something even cooler. This cutting-edge technology could offer insights into the possibility of living on another planet. While Proxima may be similar, to Earth in some ways, there are limitations. For instance, the presence of an atmosphere doesn't always mean life can thrive. Proxima b could have a scorching atmosphere like Venus, unwelcoming and harsh. And get this, if emissions are detected by the James Webb Telescope, even a brightness of 5% on the planet's daytime side could be significant, especially for a sea, star dimmer than our sun. If Proxima b has advanced civilizations, they could hypothetically use bright orbital mirrors to reflect sunlight from the day side to the night side. How cool is that? There are countless exoplanets waiting to be discovered, in our universe. They come in all shapes and sizes. Some are enormous gas giants. Others resemble our own Earth. But what do we actually know about them? One type of exoplanet that has caught the attention of space scientists is the gas giant. Some are similar in composition to Jupiter and Saturn, but are much larger. These super-Jupiters exceed even the largest planet in our solar system. That's not all. There are also hot Jupiters, gas giants that orbit extremely close to their host stars. They exist in scorching worlds with temperatures high enough to melt metal. Imagine seeing such a planet up close, with furious storms and searing heat. In addition to gas giants, there are Neptunian exoplanets, similar in size to Uranus and Neptune. These include hot Neptunes and small Neptunes, which are smaller and closer to their host stars. These planets, often shrouded in mystery, 
are difficult to study from a distance due to their thick atmospheres. And let's not forget the Earth-like, exoplanets, planets that resemble our own. They are perhaps the most exciting of all. A variety of sizes, ranging from less than our planet to twice as large, have been discovered. They even include super-Earths, which have masses more than twice that of our planet, though they are still lighter than Neptune. One of the most enticing of these planets is Neptune-like in characteristics. The most recent discovery of exoplanets is Proxima Centauri b, which orbits the star Proxima Centauri. The planet with the same name is classified as a super-Earth. It is estimated to weigh about seven Earth masses and orbits within its host star's habitable zone. Scientists are currently investigating whether it could be capable of supporting life. Proxima Centauri b is particularly intriguing because it is the closest potentially habitable planet to our own solar system. As we proceed to investigate these fascinating worlds, the James Webb Space Telescope promises to supply additional insight into their life-supporting potential and overall habitability. The allure of Proxima Centauri b deceives in more ways than one, offering the enticing possibility that it might provide favorable conditions for life. As we probe deeper into the characteristics of this exoplanet, every scientist is asking, does Proxima hold the key to determining whether life exists beyond Earth? Despite its rocky surface, its orbital position within the habitable zone, and its potential to hold water, it remains an exciting target for future exploration. However, there is a caveat. Proxima Centauri b's close proximity to its host star could expose it to harmful radiation, especially given that red dwarf stars like Proxima Centauri are known for their ferocious flares. These flares emit intense bursts of radiation that could strip away a planet's atmosphere over time, making it difficult for life to take root. Proxima Centauri b may also face tidal locking, a situation in which one side of the planet is permanently facing the star, while the opposing side remains in darkness. This could result in extreme differences in temperature between the two hemispheres, complicating the conditions needed to support life. Yet, there are still many uncertainties. We do not fully understand how the planet's atmosphere interacts with its environment. For example, could Proxima Centauri b possess a protective magnetic field that might shield it from stellar radiation? This would be crucial for ensuring the planet's long-term survival. Similarly, the possibility that life, if present on Proxima b, may have adapted to the harsh environment, cannot be ruled out. Life on Earth, after all, has managed to thrive in even the most extreme conditions, from the deep ocean to frozen tundras. Could Proxima host a different type of life, one that thrives in challenges we cannot yet imagine? In addition to these factors, Proxima Centauri b is a prime candidate for interstellar travel due to its relative proximity to Earth. While current spacecraft like Voyager 2 would take tens of thousands of years to reach the system, more ambitious projects are being proposed. Solar sail technology, for example, offers a promising solution. Using the pressure exerted by sunlight, spacecraft could be propelled at a significant fraction of the speed of light. This method could bring us closer to the goal of sending probes to explore distant exoplanets like Proxima Centauri b. The potential to one day send humans to Proxima b is an even more enticing prospect. While that goal remains far off, it continues to drive our imagination and underscores the importance of continued exploration and research. For now, the James Webb Space Telescope will serve as our eyes on this distant world. It will monitor Proxima's atmosphere study its surface, and gather essential data to help determine whether it can support life. Through its infrared capabilities, Webb can provide invaluable insight into the planet's weather patterns, atmospheric composition, and more, bringing us closer to determining whether Proxima Centauri b might one day be a second home for humanity. As we move forward, it's clear that exploring exoplanets like Proxima b offers more than just the chance to find alien life. It also represents our deep desire to understand our place in the universe. Each discovery, each piece of the puzzle, brings us one step closer to answering fundamental questions about life, the cosmos, 
and what the future holds for humanity. Whether or not Proxima B is the answer, the journey of discovery will continue to influence and inspire our future.